Greetings one and all and welcome back to another Mars Anomalies feature. We're looking at new anomalies I discovered at a site north of Asimov. This is in a region called Muharkas Terra located in the southern mid-latitudes of Mars. The original photograph is called a mid-latitude terrain sample on floor of crater. It was acquired on the 30th of May 2016 at a resolution of 25.3 centimeters per pixel. And as usual, I'm showing you images cropped from a black and white JP to a map projected file. This one's just over 900 megabytes in size. And there's a look at the terrain at the site. And the anomalies are some of these larger, brighter dots or objects that are found at the site. Okay, so we have Asimov located over here. And up to the north, we've got that site. And at the time of this video, the high-rise team had not loaded the photograph to Google Earth Mars yet. So this is about, let's see, 180, 60, so it's about 50 or so kilometers to the north of Asimov. And it's located at roughly 44 degrees, 57 minutes south, 5 degrees, 22 minutes east. And the anomaly that we'll start off with is located up to the top left. And if you use the scale indicator, we've got 20 meters there, 10. So uh, this object is roughly 8 meters in diameter. And it's another almost perfectly shaped sphere or dome-shaped object. And I have found others in Orchestera, but in Proctor. And we'll have a look at those in a moment. So there's another one, folks. Check this out. This one's a little bit smaller at about 6 meters in diameter. And now I've put them next to one another for comparison. So here's the one in Proctor. It's the same size and shape, and it's almost the perfect sphere as well. There's the a smaller one for reference. And then I found an oval shaped one in this photograph as well. So let's have a look at this strange object. This one's about 8 to 10 meters long. And uh, it's also one of these sort of oval shaped spheres or domes, but it seems to be covered in a weird material. It looks almost fluffy, or like fur. It's very strange. And then it's got this odd piece sticking out the one side. Okay, let's have a look at the object over there to the right. That's that uh, strange oval shaped object about 6 to 8 meters in length. And uh, it's very similar to this one, except this one's clean. Doesn't have anything weird on its surface. Not like this one. Very strange, like feathers or something. Don't know what that could be. And if it's something like uh, plant life covering that thing. Something like ferns or something like that. Right, let's have a look at the disc-shaped object there. About 8 meters in diameter. And as usual, we have a smaller object on the top. This one's in the center of the width, but not quite in the center of the object itself. And we've seen this pattern repeated over and over again at multiple sites on Mars. Right, let's have a look at blocks. This one's about 6 meters in length, and uh, it's got like a step to it. 
And this we've seen at other sites in Harkis Terra as well. Let's have a look at the block there, about 65 meters in length. And again, it seems to have like a step or a larger piece next to it. And there's the one from Proctor. This is also in Arkestera. Right, let's have a look at the weird objects over there. We've got like a rectangular block, about five meters in length. And then look at this strange feature. It's got like a rectangular carved out area inside, like a opening strange disc embedded there donut shape and this weird sort of spiraling part that goes around the donut shape there this is very odd I don't know what to make of this piece folks these lines or artifacts of the photograph itself there's areas or parts of this photograph where there's like a, a grid or lines I don't know what causes that but anyway so I don't think this is part of the surface itself but what do you make of this could it be some type of structure or carving some type of art who knows right let's have a look at the block over there to the bottom left not so it's about six by six meters in size and then this part over here it looks like a piece of uh, wreckage i don't know what to make of that either Right, let's have a look at the block there, about 6 meters in length. And uh, like so many others, could this be a lid with an opening top of a hatch to an underground bunker that has been uncovered with the sand moving away? Or is it uh, a smaller object in the center casting? That shadow, that there to me looks like a hole, folks. Right, have a look at this. The block in the center is about 10 by 10 meters in size. Another block over here, smaller one to the left. Oh, we've got like a rounded design to it. And then the oddities on the top. These are in the center of that block. But check out the two similar disc shapes on top of this one. I'd say they are approximately a meter and a half in diameter. There's a third one over here. Seems to be slightly embedded. There's like a pattern, some geometric pattern going on here, folks. Right, let's have a look at the items there. The block with the rounded corners is about 8 meters in length. It's got the smaller object in its center. And this to me is also rather odd. It's about 8 meters across. It's also like a dome or sphere shape. But this one seems to be uh, either breaking up or it's put together in multiple parts. Very, very odd. In this block, or two blocks similar in size next to one another it's about 10 meters across 
to get the symmetry and geometry of these two shapes it's like when they join together there's a hole in the center right let's head over to that site just north of Asimov to the named for Isaac an American biochemist and writer there's uh, some very weird stuff in here as well we'll have a look at those now here's the site and uh, a brief look at the anomalies just featured there's a couple of you I didn't include in the video like this it looks like another block with a small pot in it but it isn't quite weird enough to make it into the video as far as I'm concerned. There's another little oval shaped part that there too it's got like a half a dome shape on it but anyway this is very close to this anomaly and if I recall correctly it's about 300 meters in length it's an outline of it and uh, it looks similar to a huge ship something like a oil carrier or something like that but check my friend Saturn Ark originally discovered this item so in Asimov, let's quickly have a look at one site there. This is from the simulated color high-rise photograph. So lots of these megalithic blocks and slabs found there. Sort of a half a disk shape seems to be hollow and then uh, a weird sort of pyramidal shape see it's got one two three four five six sides that highly eroded and that's about 20 meters across and this is where my friend Saturn Ark found this huge rectangular slab or block and it has the same sort of uh, ratio in width length and height as the monolith that is featured in uh, a space odyssey 2001 a space odyssey but it is huge i think it's about 75 meters long if i recall correctly but the proportions or ratio the same as the monolith in the movie you also got some weird blocks over here that concludes this feature I hope you liked it take care everyone I'll see you in the next one soon bye for now